Hey, what's up guys? My name is Glenn and welcome to G-Strong Videos. Okay, you guys. So for today, I'm going to um, teach you and do a DIY on how to get your broken dipstick inside your car engine. So for you to understand the problem is just follow this video. Okay guys, so welcome back. So let's just analyze the problem here. So as you can see that the dipstick is already, you know, uh, already inside of the tube and it's very difficult to get even if you have like tweezers because the more that you the more that you stick the tweezer in it goes downwards okay so it goes downwards and it will be difficult if it goes like half uh, going down but so I have tried different kind of tools I have used a, um, a needle uh, tweezers and pliers but it's not pulling out so that is the problem so the more that you push this uh, broken dipstick it goes downwards and make it even more difficult to pull out Okay, so as you can see, I already purchased a new dipstick, ready to be to ready to replace the old one. But so far, I haven't removed it. So these are the the tools that I decided to use. Okay, so the small Phillips screwdriver. The problem is just is pushing it down. This is the needle. That's my second option. But the problem is whenever you you know it doesn't stick if you. Uh, if you stick the needle to the um, to the plastic, it's not going through, so it just pushes it downwards. Now, this came close, the tweezer, but the problem is it's not enough. It's having a hard time, you know, to grip the sides of the broken uh, dipstick. So instead, I have searched the YouTube channel and I found out that this is how you remove it with the use of this. This is a hook screw that what's gonna happen is that you're gonna screw it downwards and then once you screw it uh, like almost half of it and then you slowly you pull it out and that's how you remove it okay so this little, uh, little screw is going to uh, help us remove that um, dipstick all right so let's go and check it out Okay, so what I have here is the screw and what you do is that you screw it downwards and then you can feel that the thread is going through the plastic. Okay, so I'm just going to leave it like without my hand. I'm going to show you and you have to twist it slowly as you can feel that the thread is like eating the plastic and what you do is that you slowly lift it up and there it is and there you go. See? It's effective, right? And this is now the dipstick with the screw. And that's how you remove Okay, so this is the um, hook screw with the dipstick. As you can see, it sticked inside and it helped us remove. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to dispose it. Okay guys, so that's about it. It's easy, right? Just with the use of this small uh, hook screw, 
I was able to remove the uh, broken dipstick. Alright, so I hope you learned something today. So if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do click on the subscribe button. And then for those who want to get updates, please click on the bell for notifications. Just stay safe, you get vaccinated. Bye!